Now let's talk arts because it's uh, Australians are always being encouraged to to take mm -hmm. in a bit more art, whether it be yeah. performing arts or Culture. the visuals and so on. That's yeah. right. Now mm -hmm. the Australian Council for Arts has found that although 98% of us value the arts, only 15% of uh, well, in fact, 15% of us have never attended a live performance. Now, one of the biggest barriers to accessing the arts is the cost. So to try to overcome this, the Balnaves Foundation has partnered with the Sydney Opera House to offer $5 tickets to performances of The Unbelievables. To tell us more about this, we're talking with Hamish Balnaves, the General Manager of the Foundation, and with Jasmine Solis, who will be attending her first live performance with her husband and her young daughter. Jasmine, you're going next week, I believe, on Tuesday. Yeah. What, how are you feeling? Um, I'm feeling excited. Yeah. Yeah. Um, very. Yeah, this is my first time. Yeah. Well, I'd imagine that you've seen the building itself, the Opera House, yeah. um, often. Many many Sydney signers and people from around Australia would have uh, gone past the building, but to actually get inside is something different. Um, so, why haven't you been inside? Um, just never had the money or the opportunity. So mm. yeah. So that's been the biggest barrier for you, the cost, yeah. because the tickets can be very expensive. Yeah. Is that, Hamish, what prompted um, this move with the Opera House? Yeah, exactly. Um, I think uh, to get into the Art Gallery of New South Wales, there's no ticket cost. You can walk in free. Mm. Uh, the biggest inhibitor for everyone enjoying the performing arts is the ticket price. And so for us, a very easy and logical way uh, to get more people to come to the Opera House was to subsidise the ticket costs, which we do uh, with the Opera House as well. And um, the tickets are only $5 as a result, which I think makes it accessible to just about anyone, which yeah, is so great. That, that's heavily subsidised. So just tell yeah. us why then you feel it's so important to throw your support behind this. Yeah, look, uh, the performing arts, uh, experiencing theatre live, it, it can make you laugh, it can make you cry, it enriches your life, um, it, it can be magical. And it's an experience that I believe everyone should have. Um, it can enrich our lives, inspire us, and when you compare that to watching a TV screen, it's just uh, a completely different experience that is good for us all. Jasmine, is, is that something you want as part of your daughter's life, as a, a two and a half year old, I believe? Yeah. Is that something that you want to be part of her upbringing? Yes. Yeah. Why? Why, what, why would you like that? Um, because uh, she's never been mm -hmm. um, and she's never experienced that before and that I, that's something that I would love for her to see mm -hmm. like, and because there's going to be like circus magicians and all that so yeah great for a two and a half year old yeah I was just going to say is that something that perhaps you felt deprived with your own upbringing when, when you were a kid perhaps you didn't have those opportunities either no it, but yeah, I'm pretty much excited to go myself too. So yeah. yeah. Because I guess um, it's it's easier for families to head down to the local cinema, where even though we complain about the cost of going to see a movie, yeah. it is more accessible perhaps than going to a theatre, uh, particularly uh, one as expensive as the Opera House can be. Yeah. You think feels that that's the case, Hamish? Yeah, definitely. Tickets for shows at the Opera House can be anywhere from seventy to one hundred and fifty dollars per person. You, you make that a family of four, plus public transport to get there. It, it's a very expensive day. So, we think it's fantastic at Christmas time where we can make that possible. Uh, we believe the Opera House is the people's house. It should be open to everyone, and it, it's a shame that so many people haven't experienced it and haven't experienced the power of live theatre. So, For those yeah. people who haven't experienced it, what are they missing out on? I, I think uh, just the immediacy of it. Um, I would compare it to being on this TV show now compared to you being in everyone's lounge room um, doing the show you're doing now. It's a completely different experience. It's right in front of you. Um, the lights, the energy, the atmosphere, um, it, it just it's not the same as watching TV. Yeah. Now, the, the, I think you're, go, you're going to be seeing The Unbelievables at, um, at the Opera House. Do you know much about that? I'm just reading some of the blurb that comes with it and includes that it's going to be the highest aerial act ever performed in the concert hall. Sounds pretty exciting. Yeah. 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 Great show ahead. Well, Jasmine, enjoy. And Hamish, thanks very much Thank for coming you. in. Thanks for chatting to us. Good one.